Well, here is the line of the, uh, see on this, uh, if you try to go to the left of this trail, it's private property. To the right of the trail, it's Metro Parks. And I want to see how far the line goes. So. See more signs. So I can't go in there at all. Warning, and private property, and all of that. Seems like right where this line is, where the, where it's stops being mowed, that's that property. So. Yep. Funny enough, these areas in here, you know, one of the er things that people talk about, you know, wanting to have that forest area over there be houses instead is, oh, well, because there's so many people that are sleeping in there. Well, there's so many people still sleeping in these areas during different times of the year as well. That argument just kind of sucks. So here's some more. I could uh, this so you can see. Now this one in particular isn't uh, being slept in right now, but you can tell that people have. You know. Now I think it's sad that there the the amount of homeless people in in this area has just in general in Tacoma Seattle has just been skyrocketing anyway So that's it then. All right, so they've, they've just completely ruined it. <laughs> Not that Blueberry Park, the actual Blueberry Park proper is, uh, is a bad park, but it's uh, very manicured for the most part. It's, it's paved, you know. Looks like a, a perfectly manicured park. You should think it's wonderful. It is, it is a nice park for those reasons. But if you're coming for nature, or anything being in even remotely close to its natural state, it's not the one. But it is a nice park. 
and you can just see ahead of you here. You know, it's it's you know it's it's a nice park. So now we used to nickname this area over here. We used to nickname it Green Hill because at one point there, a long time ago, one of the entrances to it was a big grassy hill. So I guess I'll still call that area that just to have it as a reference. So yes, Blueberry Park itself proper is still there. I guess I'll end the video now.